make the garden a more lively and vibrant place. Um, so the idea came up of having a, having a mural on the, on the wall in the garden. So with discussions with um, Open Age, um, we got an artist in to sort of work with customers uh, to come up with ideas of what they wanted onto the, onto the, onto the mural. Um, so that they took ownership from the very beginning. It wasn't our mural, it was their mural. So the outcome was that, the outcome we were looking for was, um, I think that we'd end up with something that was made by them, belonged to them, and would be a long-term sort of uh, part of the centre, which would be uh, the mural actually being on the wall outside. And it'll make them feel part of Elgin, they are part of Elgin because it's their history that they can look back. You can think about like in a few years down, some more family members of them coming in and seeing it and that was my grandma, that was my mum. What we had at the beginning was a batch of sketches uh, and Jane came up with a proposal for, for transferring these individual items into actually a fully fleshed mural on, on the wall. With a few, um, quite a lot of participants, it was just I think three or four in particular who um, joined in. Uh, one, one was um, one of the ladies who, who's, who suffers from dementia. Um, but this particular project has just, she's been so engaged in it, she's been helping um, the artist with, um, from the beginning, doing the backgrounds and doing bits all the way through. So for her, it's just. Um, totally sort of taken up a lot of her time which had previously been totally distracted uh, and not engaged in so much and um, there's a couple of other people um, who have um, finished off their own original art onto the, onto, the, onto the finished mural as well. I just wondered if there was anything in particular out of those things that you did that you enjoyed doing? I enjoyed doing it all really. Did you? I did, I really did, yeah. How do you think you're going to feel when you see it on the wall? Oh, lovely. I'll be thrilled with it. You will? I mean, I'll be thrilled to have a good look at it. And do you think you'll show it to people? To oh, book, yeah, I would do it, yeah. And is there anything that you'd like to just say generally about the mural? I'd just love to see it up on the wall and see how it's, it's really standing out, because it is standing out from everything else. Lovely. So it's going to be lovely, so... I'm really glad that you enjoyed it. I did so. enjoy it. I enjoyed it more than anything else, actually. Oh, fantastic. It was lovely. And maybe you'll do some more art projects? Yeah, then? I will do. Yeah, I will do. Fantastic. Look of course good. I will. Good. I'm going to come and have a look, see what art projects you've done. You next. can do it. <laughs> well, it has empowered them. They've taken ownership of, of, of the whole project. They've taken ownership from the beginning where they came up with the ideas. It was them their idea to have butterflies and birds and flowers and uh, and that hasn't changed so that's come all the way through uh, and it's given them confidence because their ideas haven't been dismissed we've taken them board they've said we've actually gone through with pretty much what they wanted from that so uh, ownership and confidence for mm. these well, guys well. are really really sort of uh, giving them so much confidence it's incredible and pride it's their work, they're so proud of what they've achieved. What do you think of that? So I like that. I like it. Yeah, be happy. I would say the enjoyment that I got was seeing the customers' faces when they were doing it. Um, seeing the different sides of them come out from doing the art made a put that smile on my face saying, well, we've actually found a key and we can tap in somewhere else now. Are you both pleased with that? Yes. Do you think she's done a good job, George? Yes. Yeah. 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 Um, it's brought out um, sides of customers that we didn't see before. Um, certain customers that we have here that have um, disabilities or they can't stay still for too long, it got them in a concentration mode. So they actually took their time and got involved in it. So it helped and it helped in ways we didn't even perceive. Um, it helped him. Yeah, I think that's to it's totally, they've taken ownership of it. It's, it's, it's their project. Um, they've led on it from the very beginning. They came up with the ideas. Um, we've helped them to sort of develop the ideas, but it's purely, it's, the objectives have been achieved because they, they have owned this from the very beginning.
uh, and they voted to the very end and even in the, in the actual final mural itself they've actually been part of painting onto the board as well so it hasn't just been somebody replicating totally they've actually been part of that process I see that the, uh, that cat says to that yes a dog a bird just so to that that yes Good. So I like the um uh, the bird, um the saw, collie, mm -hmm. petty, yes, mm. yes. It's nice, it's nice different. You think? Yeah. Yes. Is it fit? Yeah. Yes. You okay? Yeah. You okay? Yeah. yeah. So? Yeah. Good girl. Yeah, I think the crucial thing of the whole design is that Jane didn't deviate from the original yeah. um, sketches or drawings. She did exactly what she replicated what the customers had done in the first place. She didn't tweak them to make them look better or change them around. It is, in effect, sort of an original mural from what the customers wanted. They recognised recognise their pieces straight away. Yeah, and it's it's, it's something that. It's going to be part of the centre for a long time because it, it, it's something that's been prepared for being outside so people can, can view it and see it all through the seasons, all through the year. Um, and for me, it's just like from the beginning of seeing two empty wooden blocks, 10 foot by 5 foot, with nothing on there, to now seeing the end product. I think it's absolutely brilliant. Uh, I would recommend this, I think Jennifer's probably say, I would recommend this to any community group, any school group, any group that works with, whether they be vulnerable adults or whether they be young people, whatever. I think the 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 outcome, the actual sort of mural at the end of it, the physical thing you actually see, is such an important sort of tool for people to take hold of. You know, it, it makes such a big state of a statement about what you're doing with your particular group uh, and I think would work in any any range of, mm -hmm. sort of sort of groups. I believe it's going to be something when it's up on the wall that's going to highlight, it's going to be a talking piece, people come in um, and art, so I would definitely recommend it.